Hello and welcome back to another episode of Planet Base with your host, The Gamesman. And here we are. We are going to be trying for the final push here today for 300 citizens. And, uh, well, colonists, should I say. Um, we now have 287. So we haven't got too far to go. 13 more peoples and we have our 300 milestone. Let's uncover the domes here. Uh, where do we do that? And the, uh, gosh, I don't even know, here we go, right there. <laughs> Excellent, so in the last episodes, we went about expanding this area here. Um, we put in the biodome, we struggled a little bit to keep it maintained, but it's now coming right. We also put in the storage and the large canteen here. A um, couple of bunks, and that was about it. Now, we are running a little bit low here on bioplastic. So what I want to do with regard to that situation, I know we're probably not going to be needing it um, for very much longer, but we are going to put in a processing plant right here. Indeed, we can do that. We're going to join her up right there. Let's get this thing built, and we're going to fill it full of bioplastic uh, processes. Our food is increasing excellently, if that's a word, excellently. Um, no, it's, it's increasing very well. And that's what we want to see. We want to see that food pumping, and we want to get these peoples in here. After this is built, I'm going to go about building a butt ton of monoliths over here. These ones here, um, just to increase that prestige a little bit more. So let's get this sucker done. 48 meals, give or take. We're doing very well with that. And of course, that's all getting produced over here. Now, I think we can go about clicking on this question mark, and it will give us a list of recipes here. Now, these recipes, I didn't see this last time. Um, restore morale, as well as nutrition. So, we've got lots of salad here. We've got salad, salad, and more salad. Wheat and mushrooms is pasta. These are the better ones, I believe. Rice and chicken. We have all of these, so they should be munching down on pasta. Hopefully. Um, I'm not too sure how it works, whether... Oh, and we've got burgers. These ones here are probably the better ones. Maize, wheat, and the vitro meat. Um, yeah, these are probably the better ones, so I'm not too sure how it works, whether... Whether or not they'll just go for the easy choices, or they'll start concentrating on the the better meals here, um, with regard to what we have in stock. So yeah, um, that was a, a new thing to find out. So let's get this done over here. And what are we waiting for? One pending resource. This guy's just walked through the wall. Did you? You did too. You just walked right through that dome. Must be like David Blaine or uh, David Copperfield <laughs> on our base here. Alright, so we haven't got any more resources to wait for and we are getting built down here. Brilliant. Okay, carrier bot's damaged but we do have one uh, workstation working on that. Let's get some bioplastic processes in here and start pumping out this bioplastic bit better than what we are doing at the moment done. Right, how's our people situations? Still the same? Righto, that's fine. Uh, wonder if we can, here we go, we've got a trading ship, let's go and have a peek at this trader. Um, yeah, he doesn't have anything we need either. So, I'm going to throw this out there right now, I'm going to say, um, I'm going to ask you guys a question, whether or not you want me to continue on the next tier of planets, or we can go into another game. Not too sure what's going to be coming up yet. Um, I have been playing uh, a game called Banished, and it's another colony type of game. It's really, really cool, to be honest. Um, so that's an option. Let's see if we can squeeze this down over here. Let's get a few of these monoliths in here. They take um, 
40 metal to be able to produce, uh, to be able to make them. So that's quite a lot of metal, but we're going to do it anyway. Let's get a couple in there and get that prestige pumped up a bit more. So we're on good standing at the moment, now we're back to excellent. Um, yeah, I want to see this go up a bit more, if at all possible. We've got a couple of extra uh, colonists here. We've got 11 more to get to get our achievement of 300 and unlock the last milestone. So we want to get that um, prestige rising. Let's get these guys in. Boom. Um, yeah, in order to get more people in. All right, let's speed the game up and get these done. Malnutrition, you say? Oh, well that's rubbish because we have plenty of meat and we have plenty of veg. So, yeah, I mean, look at this. <laughs> We've got heaps, man. We've got heaps. Meals are going down. Alright, we've got armed intruders here. Let's go and have a look at what's going on. Dudes, don't you go killing my uh, guards. Ah, oh, man. Two colonists have died. <laughs> oh, dudes. Okay. So we have had a few deaths here. Let's go back and have a look. Yeah, took back down to 287. We lost a couple of people, it's not too bad. Um, what's going on in here? Right, so we're getting uh, carrier bots being made up here. Apart from that, people, what are you worried about? Malnutrition here. What? Dude, you are so not malnutritioned. There's visitors, um, and I believe that one may have been as well. I should have looked at that too. Um, you can't control what they eat down here. I think... Yeah, I mean, that's right in the middle of the base too. Um, we have the Vitro Meat situation down here. And it looks like those are being put into storage over this side. So not much we can do in this area with regard to that. Um, how are you looking? Still pending resources. And so are you. Let's increase the speed again. And we'll see if we get any more um, warnings about malnutrition. And we'll do something about that when the time comes. Apart from that, I mean, yeah, you guys have got plenty of food. That's a certainty. But your meals are decreasing at the same time. I mean, that was up to 30. So, yeah, right. We will put a... Okay, we've got a... That's a canteen. Um, we will... Trading ship. Okay, let's go and have a look here. At you. Okay, you're gone. Okay, visitor ships. Alright. So we're nearly there, folks. We've just got to do a bit of a push to get these colonists in now. Um, a bar... Let's get a bar and stash it right here. And we'll connect those up in this direction. And we'll speed that game up. So we may have to go so far as to put another lab in with uh, a whole swag of meat as well. Not sure, I think those labs are... Oh no they're not, I thought they were um, dead ends, but it's the medical, uh, the sick bay that's a dead end. In your own time, you can be built. 
Bioplastic is now on the rise. It's looking a little bit more healthier. And food production's jumped right up to 40 again. Okay. Dudes. Where's he going to get a feed? Yep. Alrighty, he's all good. Okay, we still have a bit of unhappiness kicking around here in the base as well. Let's just speed down and see what this guy's really not happy about. Food. Well, you can go and get a... You've just walked past the... Oh, it's a bar. <laughs> right. I was going to say, he's just walked past a uh, canteen and he's hungry. Hmm. Sandstorm's detected. We will do something about that when it happens. Uh, over here, colonist ship, visitor ship, and my CPU is hitting 65, which is not a good sign. Let me just go about turning a fan on here quickly. I do have issues with overheating on my computer. Um, so that's not too much of a good thing. Basically what happens is I have to turn all my background programs off uh, whilst running a game and recording at the same time. 65 degrees is pretty hot. But let's hope we can get through this episode without a crash. That would be fantastic. And we're getting the monolith built here, folks. Let's get this uh, prestige cranking. And let's have a look here. So we're on 594. Um, how many peoples? Yeah, we've got six people away from 300 now. So let's give this game some speed. Again. Get the bar built. Get the monolith built. Brilliant. How cool is that? Trading ship has landed. Let's speed on down and yet to see the sandstorm. Okay, he's got nothing we want as well. Let's get rid of him. Colonist ship and a visitor ship here. So who do we have with regard to colonist ship? Should be just biologists? Yep. And more biologists. Cool. Alrighty, let's kit this out while we're here. With a couple of these drinks machines yet again. Some water fountains would not go astray. Um, and some leany bars. Here we go. We'll do some singles. Because we can, and might put another one right there. Uh, video screens. Let's give them some planet news. And you can go there, and you can go right there. Sandstorm is approaching soon, so it says. Said that before. <laughs> right. Who do we have over here yonder? Some more visitors. It'd be great if you could be a uh, colonist, by the way. Alright, they look legit. Let's speed up this game. How's our other monolith doing down here? It's getting built! Ha ha! Right, let's have a look at our prestige again. Oh, that's cranking. Good stuff. Alright, so I've got a couple more things to build here. We've got connections, we've got sandstorm imminent. Let's hit that alert. And you folks can get inside. Brilliant, he did that before. He's probably going to break down, but that's okay. Alrighty, looking around the base. And we're just going to have a wee poke around, just to see if we can see any red um, warnings above people's heads. They all seem to be pretty happy. I mean, there's a bit of hunger, but that's about it. Maybe a lack of canteens, perhaps. This canteen here, I'm going to, I'm going to do something a bit different with this one. I'm going to no, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to take those away, and I'm going to place the small ones in. You sir can get off that chair for a moment while I get some of these guys in. Ah, right. Okay. 
Just like that. Uh, yeah. Let's get a water fountain in. Put one there, and another one there, and a little bit of a plant situation. To keep everyone on that happy side of life. There we go. The sandstorm is now over. Let's turn this alert off. And get out of that screen. So, they'll build that up, give them a few extra seats. You, sir, are very unhappy. It's food that is becoming a problem. Or well, lack of canteens, probably... Um, let's do some more seating situations in here. Okay. Can't put one there, but we can do one there. Let's get... Can we do... No, we can't. Okay. That is alright. Let's get some water. And we've already got... Oh, we can do a TV screen right here. Okay. Let's... There we go. Brilliant. Alrighty, folks. So, how are we looking now for the peoples? Two more people to go. Ha oh, ha. Come on, colonist ships. Right, we'll give this game a bit of speed here. Ah, by the way. Here we go. One! Are you kidding me? Shocking, man. Absolutely shocking. Um, by the way, I hope you're having an awesome weekend. Uh, it should be Sunday around the other side of the world there. So I hope you are enjoying your Sundays. We can connect it there. But yeah, we're not going to do that. We're going to let them come through the uh, control center there. All right. One more person is what we are after. We're at a decent status. Our power is looking really uh, good. It is draining, but it is night time. Here we go, folks. Is it? No, it's a visitor ship. Dudes, clear off this landing pad. Well, starports. Be gone. All right. You, sir, are hungry, and you, sir, are sleepy. Okay, he's getting himself a feed here. He's having a meal. Yeah. Alright, I'm going to recycle that. And I'm going to place the smaller tables in here. Oh, okay. That's a small one. Damn it. Let's... Change that back again to one of four. There we go. Whoopsie. Alright, just having a little browse around again. So yeah, we certainly have a bit of hunger. He's going to get a meal, so he should fix himself up just fine. This guy... Gonna get some sleep. And he's going to get a meal. All right. Okay, so she'll be coming down here to get a meal. So we definitely have hungriness kicking around. Don't like that. But in saying that, we've only got one more colonist to get our milestone. So it's not too much of an issue. Um, if we do another um, series of planet base, I'm going to rework the way I do things. So for example, um, I am going to put, um, put factories and storages together in the same area as mines with an airlock. So um, we'll do something like this situation or set up here. Um, with a processing plant and a factory coming off that so they don't have too far to go um, meals, uh, canteens and bars will be located near biodomes and that sort of thing but we'll see, yeah we'll see how that pans out 
you're sleepy, but you are recovering yourself. Be happy. All right. I get um, a bit confused when I see these three triangles here. I'm thinking these are people, uh, but they're not. <laughs> All right. Elliot, you're a medic and you are carrying vegetables to a meal maker to go and get yourself some food, probably. No, but you are getting some water. You do that and visitors can clear off. Make some space here. And hopefully we get that colonist ship down here. One more person. Can we do it, folks? We got a bit of general thirst as well up here. Okay, you're just lacking food. Table has been built, finally. Here we go. Here we go. This is number 300, folks. Yes. Who do we have for our 300th person? Wow, we've got a whole heap of people. Aquil, Cruz, and AR. Alright, consolidation has been reached. Has over, oh, it now has 300 citizens. Brilliant! Alright. Well, that's fantastic. So that is all of our 10 milestones met now. Um, power storage is low, but it is kicking into daytime. Right. There is another achievement, which is at 350 uh, citizens. So it's going to get a couple more of these built. Okay, we'll put you smack bang in the middle here. Um, we'll get some redundancy in there as well. Let's do a few of them. Because we can. Yep, it's critical, but it is daytime, so they should be filling up. Not a good uh, note to end the uh, series on here, but we made all of the milestones, so I'm happy about that. I'm chuffed, some may say. Let's do that and possibly another wind turbine as well. See if we can squeeze one in here, which we cannot. There is an annoying bit of rock right there. Right. Okay, well that is a bit annoying that I can't squeeze it in there, but however. But you, sir, can be placed here. Right, we'll let them do that. How's that wind speed looking? Mm, not too bad. Not the best, and not the worst. But all of these are empty. So it just shows how much um, power we're going through here on the desert planet. Let's go back down and see how much power these monoliths take. None! But they give you a prestige of 60. Alright. Everybody is looking pretty good though. Yeah, I mean, most of these characters that are kicking around are, you know, generally pretty happy. Biologist. You can biologize this place here. You can be down here doing some work, I'm sure. Right. So. Gosh, we have a whole lot of um, bots coming out here. Wouldn't go astray to place... Um, what am I up to? We need to go back and we need to go to these indoor structures here. We need to put an airlock right out here. In fact, we can even put two or three. Ah, what am I doing? Right. And 
and another. Right there. We can do that. It's not necessary, um, but we will just for this episode. Alright, bar is in excellent condition. What does this mean? This is um, surveyed. Okay. So that's obviously surveyed from... Gosh, where is the control centre? I think it's way up here. Yeah, it's right up here. Huh. Alrighty. Um, these ones are not surveyed. Well, that's kind of odd. That one is. Yeah. How about the bar? The bar is not surveyed. But that is. Oh, that's bizarre. <laughs> okay. What are you guys up to? You're going to an airlock way the way the hell around there. And so are you. Yeah. One airlock is just not enough right here. If we can get these two built, would be great. Let's speed that game up and see what we can do about that situation. I mean, the sooner we get these built, the better we are with regard to power. Uh, we are filling up here anyway. Airlock has been built. Structures have been built. Brilliant. Start using this one, sir. He will. Brilliant. Okay. Waiting for another couple of resources here and here. Get done. And get built. Okay, we're coming back to night time now, so solar panels will stop working. And we are built over here. You are very, very, very unhappy. Whew. Ha, ah, go get yourself some food, man. Go on. Don't worry about those too much. Just go and get yourself a, a feed. He is going to get a meal. Yep. Be happy about it. Grab a drink at the same time. Go and have a sleep. So yeah, they're unhappy because they've got so far to trek. Yeah, he's going to the drinking fountain. Okay. He's going to go and have himself a sleep. Not too bad, not too bad, folks. This bar down here is hardly being used, but that's okay. Not too worried about that. I wonder... I wonder if we can... get a multi-dome in here. A little wee one. No. Thought that's pushing my luck there. Um, and, of course, we have a trading ship. We can grab these. I mean, we've got so many coins now. 112. Let's pay with, uh, yep, coinage. Okay, a little bit of overspending there. 112. So we get some beer and we get um, a little bit more food. And of course the power situation is draining. How are we doing over this side? Are we all built? Yes we are. Okay. Let's do something about the power again. And we're just going to carry on our connections as well. Okay. Alright. Okay, die, folks. Get killed. Get sorted out. Yeah, we have a another one right there as well, who's going to turn into an intruder. Or will you be okay? Yeah, look at that. Sneaky. Get dead. Okay, I think we're... Man, that was a whole heap of intruders there. <laughs> I think we're okay now. Um, now, what were we doing over here? We were going to be putting in another wind turbine here somewhere. Let's do that. And... 
Yeah, uh, we will um, put one more uh, big solar panel in if we can. We can't squeeze it in here, but we can put it over this way. So let's do that. Right, they don't have too far to walk now. Okay, folks. So, yeah, just to um, repeat myself again about this series. If you want me to continue on to the blue planet let me know down in that comment section below and um, if it's positive then we will do it if not we will move on to something else perhaps so really hope you've enjoyed the desert planet here with me uh, we had a bit of a fail at the start there um, but as we got used to the way things were set up at the start we grew pretty quickly um, so I think that Possibly giving the blue planet a go would be okay, but uh, yeah, expect a fail, that's for sure. It's going to be pretty hard. Um, I think power is the issue on the blue planet, so we'll see how that goes. But um, I'll wait for you guys and girls to get back to me on that one. Um, let's speed the game up and get these built. Man, we've got the biggest solar panel wind farm <laughs> that I've ever seen out here. But I think that we're going to be fine with regard to power. Yeah, no worries. Even some more power collectors would not go astray. Okay, you guys are unhappy because you're walking quite far. Where are all the carrier bots, by the way? 58 now. Yeah. And we've just got one more to build here, which is a solar panel. It's not going to help us during the night time anyway. Okay. And they're going straight in for a wee sleep. So this area is being used now, which is... I'm liking that, yeah. Okay. Well, this is where we're going to leave this episode, folks. So, solar panel has now been built. Brilliant. Um, yeah, I really, really hope that you've enjoyed the series of Planet Base. Um, if you have liked the episode, please smash that like button. Feel free to share this video and subscribe to the channel for more, possibly um, more planet based to come in the future. Until then, you guys and girls have an awesome day, and we'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.